The stocks discussed on Phil's Gang are not in any way a recommendation or solicitation to buy, sell, or hold. If considering acting on information presented, we first recommend you seek out a competent, licensed professional for advice. Get ready for the radio show that tells you what Wall Street doesn't want you to know. Oh, I'm a money magnet. Money, money, money's coming to me. Money sets me free. I'm a money magnet. your daily dose of how to manage your money. And now it's time for Phil's Gang on the Off the Wall Street Radio Network with your host, Phil Grandy. One of China's biggest property developers has a huge bill due this week and it might not be able to pay it. If the worst comes to the worst for Evergrande and perhaps the rest of the property sector is that Beijing will step in uh, and make sure there's not a kind of uh, massive catastrophe for, for the market. Evergrande is not too big to fail. Lie low. I would not be uh, buying under dips in China. <laughs> Unbelievable. Welcome to Phil's Gang, coast to coast, around the country, off the Wall Street Radio Network. Hey, what happened? What happened to this largest development company in the world? Everything's supposed to go under. Remember, we're down over a thousand points. And what did I say on Monday? And I said this to my radio audience. I also said to my members, chill out. It's going to be just fine. This isn't going to crash the market. This is not what crashes the market. This kind of stuff. And I said, this is a communist owned company. They'll take care of it. They always do. What's going to take this market down? is the fact our debt to what we produce globally. What are you, nuts? Our debt is insane compared to what we produce, almost nothing. The debt ratio to production is ridiculous. We're at 100% our debt. Now it's, the ratio is like 320%. That's globally. Our debt ratio to what we produce in the United States went from 62 to 125. That's insane. That is what takes down a country is when you keep printing and spending and spending and you don't produce anything. You don't sell anything. You don't produce to sell. What takes down a country is when you keep on printing money. You print and spend instead of print, produce, and spend. They're leaving the production out. Oh, they don't want to be bothered with production. Let's just print it. Keep printing it and spending it. We can do this forever. Buy our stocks. Our own stocks keep going up. People won't know the difference. But they do know the difference. When they go to the gas pumps, that's when they know the difference. They know the difference when they go to the supermarket. They know the difference that we're not producing. That our, our monetary policy switch from printing to productivity from printing to business investment to productivity to just simply spend print and spend print and spend and people see that they start understanding it you know it's interesting the federal reserve chairman volcker he was under the carter and reagan administration and he understood inflation and, and, and he understood inflation is ugly. Inflation has severe consequences. And Joey, our little Joey, like his mother called him, is running around. His big concern is the environment. The environment. Not Afghanistan. Not the border. The environment. We all love the environment. But you're not going to have any environment if you don't have a country. This dope is running around about the environment. That's what's important to him. That's what's important to him, the environment. As a global community, we're challenged by urgent and looming crises, wherein lie enormous opportunities, if, if we can summon the will and resolve to seize these opportunities. He's talking about the environment. You think he was talking about the border? You think he was talking about Afghanistan? 
No, I'm talking about the environment. But see, Reagan and even Carter, they both understood the consequences associated with this terrible, ugly thing called inflation. It gets ugly. See, when the gar government keeps printing money, that's how they get their funds, by printing money. There's no accountability. There's none. See, there's only accountability when they raise taxes on people to acquire money, to raise money. See, when they raise your taxes to get more money into the treasury, people start wondering why. They want accountability. Why are you raising my taxes? But when the government just prints money, the Federal Reserve, their printing machine, there's no accountability. So the government acquires all this money, newly printed money, no accountability, until the citizens become aware of this cause of inflation, which is greed to make the rich richer. Wall Street, hedge funds, bankster gangsters. But by then it's too late. Because see, they keep them distracted. They keep Main Street distracted. See, they're smart enough to know that as long as they keep interest rates low, keep them down at zero, and tell the folks to go out and buy a car, Buy a mobile home. Buy whatever you want. People are distracted. They don't care. In fact, they soon start, when they go to a car dealership or a mobile home dealership, they don't ask what the payment is. They now ask, what's the late payment? What's the late payment? See, they keep them distracted. So there's no accountability. If people understood what the hell's been going on since 2008, but more so from 2013 to now, they, 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 there'd be a revolt in this country. It's unbelievable. The consequences are awful. Why do you think Volcker, under Reagan and Carter, with the inflation where it is today, here, the same rate of inflation now as they had back then, Volcker ran up rates. From 11% to 20% to back the break of to, to, to break the back of inflation. He knew how ugly it was, how dangerous it was. It could bring you into a depression. He knew that. But what do we do? We just whistle and go along, and we want to talk about the environment. Oh, and don't forget Harris. She's out there flipping coins for a football game with her silly laugh. Do you plan to visit the border? Uh, um, not today. <laughs> I mean, this is, this is nuts. And every time they're asked a question, all you hear is crickets. The president yesterday, you see, he wouldn't even ask. He, here you had the the, the uh, MP from uh, 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 from Great Britain sit at the White House, and he told the British press, hey, ask me anything you want. And Biden sat there. He said, no, no, nobody asked me any questions. No, American press don't ask me any questions because he didn't want to be asked about Afghanistan. He didn't want to be asked about the border. And especially that I got so, anybody that rides Western, you know darn well what these guys were doing down, down at the border on those horses. Just like police in your own town, they ride horses to control crowds and to move a horse you take the reins they're split and you just hit the horse slightly and he and, he, and he'll move back or he'll move forward or he'll move sideways they weren't whipping anybody AOC she had no idea the closest she ever came to a horse being a horse's ass we'll be back <laughs> Want more information on this show? Go to philsgang.com or give them a call at 877-600-GANG. 
When the markets open, we watch the market all day long. And when we see there's an opportunity for a stock, and it's a stock that we've been following, we, we, there's a lot of stocks we put on our watch list, and it has to hit a certain criteria. Then when it does, we alert you. You immediately get an alert. It says, we bought this stock, X stock, at $30. So you get an alert immediately. What's better than that? I mean, nobody does that for you. But the most important thing, they'll say, okay, here's why we're getting out now. Or here's why we're taking profits. I think it's going to go down. Look, the most important thing is this. I want you to be prepared for when the market does tank or rally that you're with us. Phil's gang. 877-600-GANG. Join my gang right now. Phil's gang. 877-600-GANG. And you'll be in position and you'll sleep at night. You don't have to worry. Find out more at phyllisgang.com or call 877-600-GANG. That's 877-600-4264. That's 877-600-4264. At St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, we're fighting against childhood cancer every day. At the heart of this battle are our donors. Most of us want to make some type of difference in the lives of others. St. Jude does miraculous work. The fact that no one has to pay, it's a place where everyone is treated as an equal. Everybody is welcome here, and it doesn't matter your religion or what part of the world you're from, all that is taken away. It just gives you some hope. It's just a nice feeling to put your energy into something that really does genuinely make a difference in a child's life. There's just no greater gift. If we have the ability to help, then we have a responsibility to help. Finding cures, saving children. St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. Find out how you can help at stjude.org. What are you nuts? If the stock market can make you so rich, especially Apple and Microsoft and Google and Amazon and the rest, why are so many Americans poor? If the 401k promises you a retirement, then why is it we are in a retirement crisis? Here's the answer. Because 85% of you get out of the market too late. I fixed that with my color-coded chart, which tells you when to buy, when to sell, and when to get out. That's right, when to run like hell. Check it out. You get a free membership in the free color-coded chart for 10 days. Check it out, philsgang.com. Hi, I'm Phil Grant at philsgang.com. You probably heard me on the radio talking about investing in stocks and trading stocks. Well, this is a special message that I am sending out to you. You, the person who is the beginner, who are getting excited, you're seeing every day the stock market going up, never comes down, it keeps going up because of the tremendous stimulus that the president is putting into this market. He wants to continue this market going up while the economy's going down. That's what it's doing. The economy's going straight down. You know, banks right now, worse ever. They've gone down 40%. I mean, everything's going down. Companies aren't making money, but the stock market's still going up. And you got to be very, very careful when you get into a market like this. you got to know when to get out. And that's where we come in. So if you're a beginner and you want to start learning how to invest stocks properly and have the comfort level of knowing when to get out, when to buy, when to sell, and when to get out, contact us at philsgate.com. Join today, free for 10 days. Warning. Google, Apple, Microsoft, Netflix, Facebook, all these hot stocks are going to crash. They're going to drop as much as 60, 70%. Hi, I'm Phil Grandy, philsgang.com. Exactly what happened in the dot-com days is going to repeat itself. Remember, 85% of the people lose money in the stock market because they don't know when to get out. I fixed that with my color code technology chart. It tells you when to buy, when to sell, when to add, and when to run like hell. That's right. Make sure you check it out. It's free for 10 days. Philsgang.com. Hi, I'm Phil Grandy, philsgang.com. You probably heard me on the radio talking about investing in stocks and trading stocks. Well, this is a special message that I am sending out to you. You, the person who is the beginner. Who are getting excited you're seeing every day the stock market going up never comes down it keeps going up because of the tremendous stimulus that the president is putting into this market he wants to continue this market going up while the economy's going down that's what it's doing the economy's going straight down you know banks right now are the worst ever they've gone down 40 percent i mean everything's going down companies aren't making money but the stock market's still going up and you've got to be very very careful when you get into a market like this you got to know when to get out and that's where we come in. So if you're a beginner and you want to start learning how to invest stocks properly and have the comfort level of knowing when to get out, when to buy, when to sell, and when to get out, contact us at philsgate.com. Join today, free for 10 days.
Welcome back. Are you ready to make profits in the stock market? Why not check out philsgang.com or give us a call, 877-600-4264. Now, here's Phil. Hi, I'm Phil Grady, philsgang.com. Remember to subscribe to my Phil's Gang YouTube channel to get both my live and archived radio shows. Also, my free Phil's Take on the stock market. Also, sign up and get a free 10-day chart and membership trial. That's right. Join my gang free for 10 days. Get my color-coded chart. It's free with a membership for 10 days. It will tell you when to buy, when to sell, when to add, when to run like hell. But here's the best thing. Instead of running, what do we do? It reverses our position. So it goes. So we are making money as the market goes down. For the first time in your life, like my members, when they experience for the first time in their financial life, they're making money when the market goes down. And for the first time in their financial life, they don't care if the market's going down or if it's going up. They make money both ways. But only 20% of the people make money in the market because they make it going up, they make it going down, and they don't care if the market's up or the market's down or what the economy is doing. It doesn't matter. They're just following the money. But 80% of people lose money all the time because they're not willing to change. They're not willing to look into, hey, maybe I should make money when the market goes down. But they don't look into it. It's the same thing we're talking about with all this inflation. Inflation is a horrible thing. It's killing this country. The income inequality is getting wider and wider because the rich are getting richer and the hardworking folks on Main Street are getting killed and the middle class, soon there will be no middle class. See, this is all done purposely. They want inflation. The president wants inflation. The Democrats want inflation. The Federal Reserve wants inflation. And the Congress, whether it's Democrats or Republicans, they all want inflation. See, printing money gives our government, our Congress, free access to funds. You get the Federal Reserve printing, printing, printing billions of dollars. Then they take that money and they pass it on to the dopes in Congress, like AOC and the rest of them. God, I can't believe she's a member of Congress. They use the money for various spending, right? We know that. Accountable to nobody. Now, printing money can stimulate the economy in a very short run. That's what it's for. Stimulus is to be used for a very short period of time. It's like your grill. You put on the pilot, right? And you light it. But you don't grill the steak with the pilot light on. But that's what we're doing now. That's exactly what we're doing now. Soon, it's going to go out. The pilot light's going to go out and we go into a recession, go into a depression. And they're hanging on. This was so funny the other day when the market went down nearly a thousand points based on the largest development in China the BS story that they may default. That was a bunch of nonsense. That was given the guys on Wall Street, the fake business news network people, and all those guys you see an opportunity to buy in a dip, buy in a dip. The last thing you want to do is buy on a dip. Talk about that later. So, they print all this money to stimulate the economy, but it's supposed to be short term. When when Bernanke said he was going to do QE, print money, stimulate the economy, in 2008, he said it only would be for about a year. Here we are 13 years later. And Main Street's getting killed. They didn't tell the truth. These super low rates. Everybody loves these zero rates. And the folks aren't complaining because they can go buy a house. With low rates, they can buy a car, a trailer, whatever they want with low rates. Another advantage is inflation. The inflation that's created by all this printing. They'll tell you, well, wages go up a little bit. Yeah, it does. But the benefit of these little of wages going up is ridiculous. Because all this printing of money is killing the dollar... Your dollar is getting weaker and weaker and weaker. 
and your wages aren't keeping up with inflation. In fact, wages this year have been cut by 2.5%. All this inflation of printing money, your wages, just like your boss comes and says, I'm going to give you a 2.5% wage cut. What would you do? You'd go nuts. Well, you didn't, how come you're not going nuts and calling your congressman? Because of all the inflation they're creating, you got a wage cut of 2.5%. But you don't see that in a check. You see it at the gas pump, don't you? but you don't correlate it. You see it at the food store, but you don't correlate it. You got a wage cut. It's crazy. Remember, inflation is only beneficial to our Congress, to the gangsters in Congress, to the Federal Reserve, to the top one percentile, to the one one hundredth of one percent, our owners. It's only beneficial to them, to our large corporations, because they're, they are borrowers. Our Congress, our government, they're the borrowers. Our government, they're the borrowers. Large corporations are borrowers. And as borrowers, they get to pay back their loans with deflated dollars. I always use the example. We own China a billion dollars or trillion dollars, whatever it is. And now we go and the dollar dropped 10%, whatever, 20%. And now we tell them, hey, we don't owe you. We don't owe you a trillion dollars. We only owe now eight hundred billion, and that's how they're going to keep paying the debt down. And the biggest borrowers, being governments and large corporations, that's how they pay their debt down. They want inflation. Biden, the Congress, they have invested interest in continuing to cause inflation, which is screwing all the workers and especially the middle class, and they're getting rich. Remember, the rich get richer because their assets go up in value. Their land, their artwork, their paintings, their special real estate, their precious metals, their platinum. Billionaires gained $1.5 trillion from March 2020 to March 2021. In 12 months, they gained $1.5 trillion because of what? Because of inflation. So we got to make money on this. See, the problem is, it's the opposite for the folks on Main Street inflation. They get killed with inflation. They don't even realize it. They really don't. More when we get back, we're going to take a look at some stocks. Want more information on this show? Go to philsgang.com or give them a call at 877-600-GANG. When the markets open, we watch the market all day long. And when we see there's an opportunity for a stock, and it's a stock that we've been following. We, we, there's a lot of stocks we put on our watch list. And it has to hit a certain criteria. Then when it does, we alert you. You immediately get an alert. It says, we bought this stock, X stock, at $30. So you get an alert immediately. What's better than that? I mean, nobody does that for you. But the most important thing, they'll say, okay, here's why we're getting out now. Or here's why we're taking profits. I think it's going to go down. Look, the most important thing is this. I want you to be prepared for when the market does tank or rally that you're with us. Phil's gang. 877-600-GANG. Join my gang right now. Phil's gang. 877-600-GANG and you'll be in position and you'll sleep at night. You don't have to worry. Find out more at philsgang.com or call 877-600-GANG. That's 877-600-4264. That's 877-600-4264. Remember, when this market crashed in 2009, it should have never crashed because the chairperson of these two committees, their job was to protect consumers, protect our investments, and they're supposed to ensure that our investments are being monitored. Where were they in 2009 and 2008? They weren't anywhere because they don't do that. They take care of themselves. They protect themselves. They become richer. So you can't depend on these crooks in Congress. The stock market is a great place to be, but you just got to know this is a different market than your grandfather's market. So why don't you, for 30 days, join my gang, 877-600-GANG, try it for 30 days, $39.95, follow me, I tell you when to buy, when to sell, when to add, and when to run like hell. All I ask you is start making money, please remember St. Jude. Don't wait. Join Phil's gang today and make profits. Go to philsgang.com or call 877-600-GANG. That's 877-600-4264. That's 877-600-4264. 
I've been a Phil's Gang member since 2014. Over that time, I've generated over six-figure profits. Following Phil, his charting system has really been a huge impact on my career and my life. I would recommend Phil's Gang to the mom and pop out there. I would recommend it to parents teaching their children. I would recommend it to grandparents. If you really trust in their system, you will do well. For more information, go to philsgang.com or give us a call at 877-600-4264. With the philsgang.com membership, we bring investors right to the floor. Into the pits with Phil's daily live webinar classroom. Get inside market guidance on investing strategies. Find out more at philsgang.com or call 877-600-GANG. That's 877-600-4264. Don't have time to analyze and study stocks? At philsgang.com, we recognize that there are all types of investors, and we also recognize that your time is valuable. So we offer investing programs for all individuals. We offer investing programs for long-term and short-term positions. And philsgang.com provides quick and easy to understand investing videos that only take a few minutes to watch. With the philsgang.com investing programs, you will learn technical stock charting, how to execute your trade, and most importantly, you will gain the confidence to know when to get out of a stock and take profits. Sign up at philsgang.com. That's philsgang.com. Or give them a call. 877-600-GANG. Hi, I'm Phil Grandy. Is your business prepared to respond to any emergency in the workplace? Well, you better be. Let over 30 years of law enforcement experience go to work for you. Boyd Investigative Group is here for all your business security needs. I know. I use them. They're terrific. Call today for your free confidential consultation. 941-724-4535. That's 941-724-4535. Or visit them on the website, boydinvestigativegroup.com. License number A1900. Zero two zero. With the philsgang.com membership, we bring investors right to the floor. Into the pits with Phil's daily live webinar classroom. Get inside market guidance on investing strategies. Find out more at philsgang.com or call 877-600-GANG. That's 877-600-4264. Don't have time to analyze and study stocks? At philsgang.com, we recognize that there are all types of investors, and we also recognize that your time is valuable. So we offer investing programs for all individuals. We offer investing programs for long-term and short-term positions. And philsgang.com provides quick and easy to understand investing videos that only take a few minutes to watch. With the philsgang.com investing programs, you will learn technical stock charting, how to execute your trade, and most importantly, you will gain the confidence to know when to get out of a stock and take profits. Sign up at philsgang.com. That's philsgang.com. Or give them a call, 877-600-GANG. Welcome back. Are you ready to make profits in the stock market? Why not check out philsgang.com or give us a call, 877-600-4264. Now, here's Phil. Hey, welcome back to Phil's Game. If you listen to me on my YouTube channel, please hit subscribe, like, and share. Would really appreciate it. Okay, so we're talking about who benefits from this inflation. Not us, not Main Street. You think you do. Because those zero rates, those low rates are getting on furniture. You don't have to pay payments for a year. The low rates are getting on wave runners and snowmobiles. And those low rates, you're, 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 you're getting on the uh, uh, hubcaps you bought or whatever. Low rates on a house. But you don't realize. Most people don't realize. A lot of people do. Most people don't realize that catches up to you. Because what happens is, as the inflation moves higher and higher, the debt gets more and more expensive, and soon you can't pay the debt back. You can't pay the debt back. It's the same thing for our government. Why do you think the government will keep this inflation going? They don't care if it hurts Main Street. Do you think a president that doesn't care about leaving Americans behind in Afghanistan don't care about those poor people on the border in Texas. He doesn't care. All he keeps talking about is the environment. Goes to the end, talking about the environment. 
We love the environment, but right now he has to do something about the state of this country and the inflation that's killing us. Give you an example. Inflation kills the American dream. Kills the American dream. Think about it. Think about housing. Housing costs. Due to inflation, a median price home has increased 15% in 12 months. Median price home? I'm talking about homes in this country average about 356000 In In 12 months, one year, up 15%. Wages haven't gone up 15%. Are you kidding? This has killed first-time home buying. First-time home buyer is this country is this country what makes this country wonderful because when a person gets out of the college they start a family they get married they gotta get that first home 40 percent 45 percent of sales used to be first time home buyer they're gone there's no more first time home buyer they can't afford the increase of 15 percent in 12 months up to three hundred fifty six thousand dollars location location locations real estate right now, if you're a head of a household and you're seeking the American dream, putting a roof over the heads of your family, and you're within the goal of living in a and working, living and working in a desirable area, desirable city in America, that dream's dead. You can't afford it. Do you know right now the first two and a half weeks, take your monthly paycheck. First two and a half weeks is what is costing you, costing you to keep your family under a roof. Two and a half weeks. That, that, and that, was, that goes to your house, your payments. You worked, so that's about 100 hours. This is what inflation has done. Are you nuts? But guess what? While the startup homes the starter home is falling. Those who are buying homes a million dollars or more have increased by 40%. That's called income inequality. And Biden is running around talking about the environment? What are you, nuts? When sales of homes a million dollars or more increase 40% in the same time frame, that homes, the median home price went up 15% a year to 356000 And the first time home buyer is dead, dead, dead. They're not buying. And that's this country is the first time home buyer. Because that first time home buyer, when they get married and they have kids, they got to buy furniture, they got to buy lawn furniture, they got to keep the house up. This is all good revenue for our country, for our nation. The millionaire. He pays for his house for cash. And when he makes money, he puts it in a pile of the rest of his cash. He never uses his own money. He goes to Wall Street and borrows money. So this is what's going on. So what do we do? What do we do? Well, you do what I do with my gang. we got to get everybody in a position that we're ready when this market's going to crash. And you don't think this market's going to crash. Most people don't. They think it's going to go on forever. No. When you see your neighbor out of work, you go to work one day and he's not leaving for work, and you say, hey, Joey, Joey, what are you doing not going to work, Joey? I got laid off. Whoa, that's when it starts. That's when it starts. And then the weekend comes and you're starting to pay your bills. All of a sudden, you got to decide. Wait a minute, I can't afford to pay my student loan. I can't afford to pay my credit card and my house mortgage. I got I to gotta do one or the other. I better take care of my credit card. I'll take care of my credit card. Let my house, house mortgage go. That's when the crash will occur. And it's coming. It's coming quickly. It's coming quickly. We've been going through this now for 13 years. So here's the thing. Put yourself in the position if the market keeps going up. Take, for example, a stock like uh, DDOG. If you got into the stock DDOG when it turned green, remember it was red, our color-coded chart, which is patent, gave us an alert that it was going, money was starting to come back in. So our members who are in DDOG, our investors who are in DDOG, if they, from 
if they got back into DDOG, I think it was around June 4th or 5th, and they're still in it today and still making new highs today, when that market went down 1,000 points Monday, it didn't even touch the stock. They're up 69%, 69%. Now, some people, some of my members got in it later on, later on in that stock, and they're up 15%. Again, when the stock turns green to buy, not everybody gets in at the same time because not everybody joins the gang at the same time. But it doesn't matter. You're going to be one of the you're going to be one of the twenty percent who continually make money because when this stock decides to go down, we're not going to get out and say, "Gee, we better get out. DDOG's going down. We better get out. Get me out. Get me out before it goes down." No, we take our profits. Our color coded chart turns yellow, gives us a heads up, call to action, and then we switch our position. Like a click of a button, switch the position to short. And as it, money, as, as it starts going down, we make money on the way down. We did the same thing. We did the same thing with, it, with uh, Costco. Costco, look at this stock. This was a boomer of a stock. A lot of my gang members got in in June. In June. Up 45 percent. Some got into July, got in a little later, July and August. Some of them are up 22 percent. But it doesn't matter because it gave us a signal. It was green to get in. And right now, the most important thing is it will tell us when to not only get out to take profits, it will turn yellow, and then it will turn red, and we just switch our position and we short it. That's just two stocks I'm talking. We do this all day long. So the idea is to think about it. If you're sitting there with a stock, no longer are you going to say, God, the minute I got in, it went down. The minute I got out, it went up. That will never happen to you again. And if we get more and more of you to understand this, that the 20% who make money consistently, there's a reason for it. Another reason not only do they they, they, they they know when to get out and they know in the short, but they don't have five, six, seven, ten. I did, I'm sorry. They don't have like 50 stocks they're following. They stay with the same stocks, the same stocks all year, the same best Dow 30 and the same best S&P 100. All you need is uh, six stocks, and that's where you make your money. I'll explain when I get back. Want more information on this show? Go to philsgang.com or give them a call at 877-600-GANG. What if you could have an in-depth understanding of the stock market just like the pros? Well, thanks to Phil Grandy and philsgang.com, you can. philsgang.com offers comprehensive, up-to-date market information designed to help you understand and anticipate market behavior. With philsgang.com, you'll build your investing confidence even through down cycles and periods of uncertainty. Go to philsgang.com, philsgang.com today, 877-600-GANG, 877-600-4264. You know, breast cancer kills 113 people every day. That's unacceptable. African American women die from breast cancer nearly 41% more than Caucasian women. That's unacceptable. Breast cancer is the leading cause of all cancer deaths for Hispanic women. Breast cancer is unacceptable. Together with Susan G. Komen, we're committed to reducing U.S. breast cancer deaths by half. And we're going to do it by 2026. Visit Komen.org slash unacceptable. Hi, I'm Phil Grady, philsgang.com. You probably heard me on the radio talking about investing in stocks and trading stocks. Well, this is a special message that I am sending out to you. You, the person who is the beginner, who are getting excited. You're seeing every day the stock market going up, never comes down, it keeps going up because of the tremendous stimulus that the president is putting into this market. He wants to continue this market going up while the economy's going down. And that's what it's doing. The economy's going straight down. You know, banks right now are the worst ever. They've gone down 40%. I mean, everything's going down. Companies aren't making money, but the stock market's still going up. 
And you got to be very, very careful when you get into a market like this. You got to know when to get out. And that's where we come in. So if you're a beginner and you want to start learning how to invest stocks properly and have the comfort level of knowing when to get out, when to buy, when to sell, and when to get out, contact us at philsgate.com. Join today free for 10 days. Thinking about investing in the stock market? Go to philsgang.com where we have over 50 years experience in trading and investing in the stock market. Phil's Gang teaches you how to make profits in the market with stock chart analysis, up to the minute alerts, and always keeping you informed with professional guidance and long and short term positions. Go to philsgang.com or call one of our professional staff to answer your questions. 877 600 Gang, that's 877 600 4264. Stop wondering about your financial future and start doing something about it. With the Phil's Gang com membership we bring investors right to the floor into the pits with phil's daily live webinar classroom get inside market guidance on investing strategies find out more at philsgang.com or call 877-600-GANG that's 877-600-4264 don't have time to analyze and study stocks at philsgang.com we recognize that there are all types of investors and we also recognize that your time is valuable so we offer investing programs for all individuals we offer investing programs for long-term and short-term positions. And PhilzGang.com provides quick and easy to understand investing videos that only take a few minutes to watch. With the PhilzGang.com investing programs, you will learn technical stock charting, how to execute your trades, and most importantly, you will gain the confidence to know when to get out of a stock and take profits. Sign up at PhilzGang.com. That's PhilzGang.com. Or give them a call. 877-600-GANG. What are you, nuts? If the stock market can make you so rich, especially Apple and Microsoft and Google and Amazon and the rest, why are so many Americans poor? If the 401k promises you a retirement, then why is it we are in a retirement crisis? Here's the answer. Because 85% of you get out of the market too late. I fixed that with my color-coded chart, which tells you when to buy, when to sell, and when to get out. That's right, when to run like hell. Check it out. You get a free membership and the free color-coded chart for 10 days. Check it out, philsgang.com. Welcome back. Learn, invest, and make profits with Phil Grandy. Simply go to philsgang.com. Now, here's Phil. And welcome back to Phil's Gang. Join my gang every day. And I've told you this before. The way it works is this. The 20% that make money in the market consistently have no more than five or six stocks in their portfolio. Now, they do have what you call bonus stocks. We do too. But when you ask a professional, he'll tell you 80%, 80% of that money he's making is coming from those five or six stocks. He selects the best five or six stocks out of the Dow 30. He selects the best five or six stocks out of the S&P 100. He stays with those all year. He has an advantage because he doesn't care if the market goes up or the market goes down. The reason people have too many stocks and these 401ks have too many stocks and they can't manage them well for you is because if you don't know how to make money when the market's going, you are always got to find that better stock. So if you buy a stock at 20 it goes up to $40 and you get out, remember what happens. All the other stocks went up too. So when you get out thinking your stock's going to go down you try to find another one, you're buying an overpriced stock. You're buying an overpriced stock. That's why 80% of the people lose money. And if you have just five, six top stocks, like we do in our portfolio, every day at 2 o'clock, Stephen goes through those stocks. That's our portfolio. He takes the color-coded chart, and he tells our members what to do with each stock. Lows continue to hold this one long with your stop at 3% trailing. You can see it pushed back up today. If we can take out the high. For he explains. So if you don't have time to come to class or if you don't want to come to class. At 2 o'clock, these are posted. You come home after work, 6, 7 o'clock at night. You finish eating. You go. You spend a few minutes. Say, okay, let's see. What does Steve say to do today? And you do it. How hard is that? But the beautiful thing, when he says, okay, okay, like our DODG, 
up 69%, all of a sudden it's going to turn around and come back down. The 80 people who lose money are going to get it out of DODG and they're going to go try to find another stock. But all those stocks in that same category in that same category, if it's an industrial stock, pretend it's an industrial stock, they got to go find another industrial stock. But they're all up. So now they're purchasing stock that's overpriced. They go, remember, you make your money on the purchase. When you buy a stock, you make it on the purchase. So when the stock goes up 30 40% and you take that profit, the reason 80% of people lose money is because, one, they don't know how to get out. And they go look for an overpriced stock because they're unwilling, even though they know the stock is going down. That's how silly it is. Even though they're getting out saying, get me out, get me out, quick, get me out, get me out. And, and they get out. Wouldn't you think they would just switch their position to sell short and make money on the way down? For heaven's sakes. Okay. Look, once you join the gang, we hope, when you start making money, you'll remember St. Jude Research Hospital. What a great organization. St. Jude. Now, you don't send the money to us. You send it directly to St. Jude. Another thing. We keep you up to date all day long. Good stuff. Thing, we don't just send you an alert. Things you need to know. We're right there with you. And again, remember, our members have a portfolio. Not only are the six stocks, but we have another portfolio called the Working Investor Stock Portfolio, which has a mixture, a combination of ETFs and individual stocks. You can pick either one you want. Or after the 10 days, you can decide to build your own portfolio from the S&P 100 or Dow 30. It's up to you. Look, Powell said today, do you believe Powell? Powell says, no, we're not going to raise rates, but we're going to sometime. Powell and 11 other bankers, you're going to believe them? They've been trading with inside information. They've been make, making trades knowing when they're going to raise rates or not raise rates. Uh, they have all the inside information. And the 11 members of the board have been taking that information and trading with it. Just like Pelosi, she went from 40% to 100%. In profits because she had inside information but you don't need to have inside information you just need a good chart and we have that good chart it's called the pro 2 color-coded chart and it works the analytics work the beautiful thing is when you have money and oh listen to this let's talk about that listen to this to the financial system from Evergrande alone will be manageable. Do remember, not to be a spoiler, similar comments like manageable were made about mortgage-backed securities in 2007, and we all know how that turned out. Okay, that was, they told us, remember, that don't worry about the development company, that they could manage a $300 billion loss. Do you believe that? That's ridiculous. But here, I, I, I played, I racked up the wrong cut. You did buy on the dip, and you bought Caterpillar yesterday. Can you tell us why and what your move suggests that you don't agree with that? Because because I'm focused on fundamentals. I don't know how to time this market. I don't, know, I don't think anybody does. Oh, really? 8,000 people do. Time the market? What's wrong with timing the market? If you know, your color-coded chart tells you a stock's been going up and you're up 30% or 10% or 5% or 100% and it tells you money is coming out and it's going to start going down, what's wrong with that? You're, you're depending on fundamentals. Are you out of your mind? You're depending on profit margins, operating margins, return on assets, return on equity, operating cash flow, free cash flow. Oh, you're studying all that stuff? We did that in the 70s. We did that in the 80s, and we stopped because once they got rid of the manufacturing economy and we switched to a finance economy on Wall Street, and once they turned the stock market, remember the stock market is no longer independent. It's no longer free. The stock market is rigged. It does not reflect the health of the economy at all. 
especially when the stock market is linked to financial engineering. When you have financial engineering, no wonder you, you lost money. When you're looking at fundamentals, how can you look at fundamentals when the market is rigged? And I hope they never unrig it because with it being rigged, you can make more money. Because look, we've gone over 300, I think 30 days now without a 5% pullback. When the S&P and the Qs have been going up, we told our gang members, put in a stop 5 or 6%. That's all, put a stop in. It'll go back up and it did. Now, if she doesn't make a new high, and, and I'll give you this information, free. If the S&P can't get back, right now it's trading at 438. If it can't get above, if it can't get above, that's what I'm saying, 454, then this market's going to collapse. If it goes from 437 and stops around 447, can't make it to 453, that's called the lower high, it's going to collapse. It's going to give us a 10% correction. So if you think if you're investing a lot of money and you're going to buy on this dip, you're out of your mind. You're out of your mind. Same with an individual stock. If you have an individual stock and it pulled back the other day, it pulled back, you don't you don't go in and, and, and buy on the dip. What are you, nuts? If you had a stock the other day that was at, let's say, $200 and she dropped down to, let's say, 216 or let's say she was at 234, she dropped down to 216. You don't buy on the dip. What are you, nuts? Because it means the money trend is still going down. Still going down. The trend is down. Money's coming out. You don't do that. You know when you buy that stock again? When it makes a new high. The high, I'm looking at Honeywell. The high on Honeywell, if that's your stock, was at 236. It's trading at 216. You've got to be out of your mind to invest in that stock until it makes that new high. Why would you buy the same real estate twice? Doesn't make sense, does it? Look, join my gang and you'll see the color-coded chart. And what we do here makes it so easy for you. It really does. Once you finally say, you know what? I don't give a damn if the market goes up or down anymore because I make money both ways. And finally, I'm out of the 80% camp and I'm in the 20% camp. That's when you've made it. That's when you know, hey, I love the market. You have been listening to Phil's Gang with your host, Phil Grandy, on the Off the Wall Street Radio Network. Off the Wall Street Radio Network. Remember to visit Phil's website at philsgang.com. That's philsgang.com. Or call the office, 877-600-4264. That's 877-600-4264. It's up to me to make money.